<laughs> He's like, thanks for bringing me on and exposing me to midgets and fucking trannies. What's up guys, John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. We're back with another reaction video. Today's topic is to guess who's had plastic surgery. Okay, a lot of you guys watching have never felt fake tits. Okay, I love them. I think they're fucking awesome. The rationale there, uh, personally, is a lot of girls with big natural tits tend to have like fatter arms and a fatter stomach and this kind of stuff, extra body fat in other places. Whereas when a girl is in shape and has a flat toned stomach, and does not have a lot of excess body fat, her boobs tend to be smaller, like a B cup or even an A cup, okay? There's plenty of exceptions, but the general rule is lots of girls that are in shape have smaller tits, but when you pop fake tits on there, now you have the best of both worlds, okay? So like the ideal body type for me is a girl with a really pretty face, big fake tits, uh, flat stomach, and a nice juicy ass, okay? Everything in nice proportions and this and that, okay? But a lot of the girls with big natural tits have too much fat in other places which is a problem for me and for lots of others so uh before we jump into this reaction if you're looking to get way more phone numbers get way more dates get way more matches on the online dating apps to know how to run your dates and close your dates properly to know how to do your cold approaching properly in street smalls cafes bars and clubs know how to build your online profile what to text what to message on the apps all those things will be solved in a short eight weeks. Okay, don't hesitate. Jump on a free 30-minute call. We'll walk you through pricing and details, what the program entails. Okay, it is the leading program in the industry by far. Okay, the best program in terms of the results that I'm getting for students. Nothing compares even slightly. Okay, lots of the guys are going on to do 50 to 100 girls a year and putting on about one new rotation girl per week. Okay, don't hesitate. Jump on that free 30-minute call. Also, please subscribe below if you're not yet a subscriber for alerts of two new videos a day. Okay, so here we go. You can touch it if you want. Oh, fake asses are awesome too. There was a bunch of those in Colombia. <laughs> this girl's face. And in uh, in Brazil, I just experienced one of these this past weekend. I don't care. <laughs> Dude, why does that feel so natural though? <laughs> Technology. Hello. <laughs> Hi, I'm Isla Dizon. That chick was in the fucking, in one of the other reaction videos where she was doing the speed dating shit. Or whatever. I am Sharam Salami. I am a plastic surgeon here in Seattle. Today you're gonna be guessing who's had plastic surgery. Oh okay. Like honestly, I've considered cosmetic surgery before. What have you considered doing? Uh actually a tummy tuck. I wanna get my a nose job. I would love to get a boob job and I would love to get my lips filled. I was hoping you could get a leg job and put a stilt in there and make myself taller. I'd do it all. I'd go crazy. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Hi. Okay. I'm John. Hello, John. Nice okay. to meet you. Would you mind just turning around for me? Mm-hmm. Great. It'd be hard to tell just by looking at you if you've had anything done from a cosmetic standpoint. Let me turn around. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Weird. I didn't have penis <laughs> reduction. <What? laughs> the chick's trying to look at his cock. <laughs> Sorry. Wow. Yeah. <clears throat> um, yes. I'm going to say that you got a nose job. Can you raise your eyebrows up? You've had some Botox? Yep. Give, just give me what's up. I have not had a nose job. I've done filler in my lip. Wait, how much was the lip fillers? Like a thousand. And you have good teeth. You've done something to whiten your teeth. Bleach, yep. Yeah. Did I cover everything? I covered pretty much everything. The only thing else that I've had is Kybella. Yeah, so that's an injection to try to dissolve fat. There's kind of pros and cons to it. Hurts like hell sometimes. <laughs> yeah. It does burn. All right, Come thank on. you. That was good. All right, I'm, call I'm calling that a win. I'm just gonna say, I'm not keeping score, but I'm totally keeping score. Hi. Fuck. Oh, sorry. I know, right? Yeah. Can he come down here? We're gonna see if a midget had plastic surgery. Would that be insulting? <laughs> I don't wanna. Come here, come here. No, get on your knees. Lift your eyebrows up. Okay. I can only do one side. I think you may have gotten um, some sort of injection Botox or other. <laughs> Just making like a Frankenstein face. Otherwise, just because your skin seems really firm and nice and your forehead doesn't really have any wrinkles in it at all. Nothing else pokes at you. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I also had a fake dick put on. Okay, for those of you that don't follow my channel very regularly, I had some plastic surgery stuff done as well. I had a hair transplant. We'll pop up an info card with the thumbnail on that. I had uh, eye bag fillers as well as Botox put on. 
and they they also did some uh, hair transplant in part of my beard that was missing a spot as well. I had teeth whitening done, um, and I also had a collagen injection set done. That's going to really take effect more in the next couple months, rejuvenating a lot of the cells to more youthful levels. Okay, I'm going to be 38 next month. But you can do some of these things to look better. Okay, let's keep going. <laughs> what I do see is that um, you probably have a, a, what's called a facial nerve palsy. Have you been told that? Yes, uh, it's a nerve paralysis on uh -huh. the side, not this side, yeah, obviously. Work, I've been used yeah. to this for 36 years, so yeah. it's like, eh, but it's, it's really annoying. So other than that, I mean, you're just wonderful. I don't know, I don't see anything else. I have a feeling you're one of my no plastic surgeries. No, I don't think she's had cosmetic surgery. I think she's had multiple surgeries. I mean, I see scars on knees, so I wouldn't consider like surgery on the knees or the back as yeah. cosmetic. How many surgeries do you think I've had? At least 10. 21. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Have any of them been for cosmetic? Yes. I've had it looks like she has fake tits, possibly. I had uh, an orthognostic jaw surgery. I guess you can say like facial reconstruction. I used to joke around, but my 20th surgery was gonna be for like truly for me, and that was my breasts. Mm. Can you tell? Uh, uh. <laughs> it looks very natural and balanced Thank with you. you, so that's great. Especially since I'm not wearing a bra. So, yeah. A little more information than we needed. I but know. We're fine. Yeah. Let's keep it going. Oh, I'm yeah. proud. We're good. We're not in no, New no, Orleans, please. so we're good. <laughs> we're good. Pleasure. Pleasure. Thank you so much. The dude's like, don't worry, I'm going to fucking bend you over here. You guys. <laughs> Let's do this. Let's do it. Jesus Christ. That's one big booty. Troll, you're right now. You're right now. Okay. You can touch it if you want. I don't care. It's so weird. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, I'm sweating. Mm -hmm. What do you think stands out? Uh, well, yeah, mm, mm. could you turn around again for me? <laughs> I feel like there are implants. Cause that, like you could set a cup on it. It feels like one of those like really nice like beds that you bounce on. This is totally a fake booty. My butt's not fake. That's <laughs> That's awesome. Not my butt, no! no. Oh, That's that. real. That's a real butt. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. A thing of beauty. Yeah, the ass is real. Has anyone ever asked you if your ass oh, is Oh, I get asked every day. Really? Almost every day, yeah. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. <laughs> That's a real butt! <laughs> Hi. You're gorgeous. Dude, you look like a Barbie. <laughs> oh my god. You already know where I'm staring. I think your tattoo is making me want to look at your breasts, I guess, and make me think that that was... <laughs> She's like, what? I had no idea putting a tattoo on my tits would make people look there. Those may or may not be uh, <laughs> real, fake. Um, anyways. Um... It's got to feel it. Do you want to feel mine? For science. <laughs> How is this shit allowed on fucking YouTube? It's not fair. I get shit removed for much, much uh, easier. Or much... Uh, more team things. <laughs> We're doing science right now. <laughs> Nose is really symmetrical. Um, can you bring your chin up for me? I don't see a scar. So I don't think you've had a rhinoplasty. And in the way you're wearing your top, you've either had an augmentation or you're wearing a bra that's accentuating that. Okay, this chick had fake tits and also looks like she had some work done on her face. I boob job? You got a boob job. I got a boob job. Yeah, she got, she got a boob job. This might be offensive if I'm wrong. Okay. It sounds like perhaps maybe you were uh, uh, born a man or something like that. <laughs> this dude's calling this chick a tranny. And then went through uh, surgery to uh, become Haley. Clocked. It's all good. <laughs> so I did have a sex change, uh, gender confirmation surgery or something. Wow, he spotted the tranny, very nice. Something like that. So I've had my chest done. Uh -huh. I did have a slight juvederm, and I also just got, uh, had a vaginoplasty in April as well. Well, I can tell you for sure we would not have been able to see the third I one. <laughs> and if I did, you could just take my medical license right now. <laughs> I mean, did everything go well? Are you able to use like your parts how, how they would be used? Uh, everything works. I have like six inches of depth. Nice. Yeah. He's like, let me go check that out real quick. Yeah, and it's like all the hardware's there. It gets wet. You can be orgasmic. Oh, oh, sweet. That's yeah. awesome. 
I have a labiaplasty coming up. A little more information we needed, but okay. The labia. <laughs> He's like, thanks for bringing me on and exposing me to midgets and fucking trannies. Prostate's kind of like a facelift for your vagina. They do that? Yeah, a lot of women who have children actually get labiaplasties too. Yeah, I probably because should look into that. Lips. I'm honestly Same scared shit. to see what it looks like. I'm like, I'm afraid. <laughs> it's so nice to meet you. It was good meeting you. She's like, nice to meet you, bro. First thing I noticed, really good looking guy. You clearly moisturize, like, a lot. Dude strikes me as gay. Your skin is like I like greasy as fuck. No, like that's probably like the best skin I've ever seen in my life. Okay, I'm gonna say you have had plastic surgery. Can I get closer? Can I look at you? Okay, mm -hmm. great. Yeah. Um, this dude's like bi curious on the left. Can I get a little bit closer? He's like, yeah, you can get closer, bro. Oh yeah, those lips. I'm gonna say, <laughs> yeah, those are yours. <laughs> You have had lip fillers. I would say probably not had anything done. So, have you had anything done? I have not had anything done. Yes. <laughs> Fuck, wow! Those are your lips? Those are my lips. Gee, are you looking at his lips? I use lip pumper. I use lip pumper before I suck dick. But what? it's just like a topical, it's like a chapstick. What the hell? Do you want to try some? Can I try some? Do you want to try some right now? Wait, is it FDA approved? Probably not. Try it, here. Okay. It's gonna tingle. Oh, fucking Jesus. <laughs> I'm salivating. Do you yeah. see it? Don't lick it. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, she's literally drooling. <laughs> so would you like to put it on? I'm good. I, I, thought, I thought it'd be a no. <laughs> nice so to, nice meet, to you. meet you. Thank you. Good luck on the lips. I'm going to be talking funny the rest of the time. You should have saved that for last. Hi. Hi. I'm Marty. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. May I look at your yeah. body and... <laughs> He's like, I look at your body and... I'm not impressed. Your breasts. Yeah. Okay, thanks. This is a really nice juicy butt. Your butt's real, right? I don't actually see stretch marks. Have, have you ever had kids? Here it is. Okay. Because you had kids, I'm guessing you had a tummy tuck. A breast operation, maybe a tummy operation, maybe some liposuction. We call it a mommy makeover. I'm just gonna say no. That's what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say you're all natural. Am I wrong? I uh, yes. What have you gotten done? Breast lift, mm -hmm. liposculpture, tummy tuck. You had a tummy tuck yes. too? Anything no. else you think? No, I feel like it was just... Really? I thought that was a natural, just... Well, there was a one upon a time. <laughs> you did the fat transfer to my butt. They transferred this to there? But, yeah. Fuck. Well, they did a good job. <laughs> <laughs> okay, give me a hug. It was so nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You look amazing. What's your name? Anna. Anna, hi. Nice to meet you. Sharam. Your nose, you have a bridge, which is surprising because a lot of Asians, we don't have bridges. Can I touch <laughs> They put a nose Your bridge. nose? Mm hmm Okay. Can I, I'm just going to hold right here. Whoop. I was feeling to see if I could feel an implant. Mm -hmm in there and I would say <laughs> probably not it's hard to tell no I'm gonna I'm gonna guess the nose I didn't get my nose done damn it <laughs> so you're, you're all natural aren't you I am all natural now oh wait, wait did you take out breast implants yes do you take a lot of selfies though when you have them <laughs> not really oh. I was covering them more really I thought I was gonna be like yeah but no you're not like really uncomfortable it felt like everybody was just like staring at your boob. I wouldn't mind if you were staring at my boob more. I'd be like, dream come true! Do you like your body now more than you did before? Like, yeah, I think I appreciate myself more. Yeah. I don't have any feelings on like one third of my breast. And some people lose sensation on their nipples. Now I'm like scared. Yeah. You're like scaring me. Do you have kids? Yeah, there's like a little quick uh, boob job one-on-one -on -one shit. If you go under the muscle, okay, underneath here, and they come around, it's very unlikely you'll lose a sensation in the nipples, so that is the preferred way. Two. Any girls? Two. Would you say, yes, go ahead and do it for your kids? Um, for my kids, it's difficult to, as a father, because you look at your girls as perfect. But I think, ultimately, I would be supportive of them. So nice to meet you. Thank <laughs> nice you so much. Too. Hi, I'm Kirby. Davion. Okay. My last contestant. Okay, let's see. Are you? <laughs> You're dreading this? Out of all the people, this is probably the most nervous one I've been. I'm, I'm yeah. making you the most nervous? Yeah. How am I making you? Some kind of hair transplant thing going on? Weird. The most nervous. 
I don't know, because you're a doctor. <laughs> you have really, really pretty eyes, but that's not like a thing. You can't get those enhanced. Lift up the shirt. Okay. We got some abs right there, though. I can see those. Ah! <laughs> I see, I see the scars. No, I don't think you have had anything done. I don't think you've had anything done. I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. I would be surprised. Does that mean that you transitioned your chest from, let's say, my chest, your chest? That's correct. Wait, what was your plastic surgery? I had a double mastectomy. Oh, I don't know what that means. So, I had like my breast removed. Ow? Yeah. Why? Because I was like, I was born a female and then I transitioned to a male. Oh, okay. Yeah, another training. Oh, really? Yeah. Congratulations! Dude, that's awesome! <laughs> so I had a double mastectomy. So, yeah, so I had my breast removed. <laughs> this dude's face. <laughs> Last year, actually. So, yeah. He's like, damn, too bad I didn't meet you last year. I could have grabbed those titties. Yeah. What? Yeah. I used to work with kids, so I tell them I got attacked by a shark. <laughs> and so they always tell their parents, they're like, Mr. Damien was attacked by a shark. He's so cool. So a lot of people just think I was attacked by a shark. <laughs> That's fantastic. Congratulations. Thank you. That's a big step. Yeah. It must have been scary as hell. It was scary. I was like, damn, I'm not ready. Huh. And then when I got to the hospital, I was getting prepped. And then I got out of the hospital bed and started putting my clothes on. I was like, I'm not ready for this. And my mom was like, I took off of work, so you're doing this. <laughs> so I... You're getting rid of those titties, bro. <laughs> and I was like super happy. I was like, I'm glad I did this when I did it. Well, I wish you a lot of success. Thank you. You're going to do great. You don't have to be nervous. Why do you make baby I'm not... Do I make people nervous? What is this? That's, uniform. Yeah. yeah, it's the uniform. <laughs> this is not my idea, by the way. They sent me like seven emails saying, wear your scrub, so... <laughs> <laughs> Gotta look official to get the doctor's opinion. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you are looking to get lots of matches, lots of phone numbers, lots of dates, don't hesitate. Jump on a free 30 minute call. Okay, we will sort you out, answer all your questions. I get emails all the time. Guys are like, I'm afraid to go on the call. I'm not sure, uh, you know, what this program's about or what's the price. Uh, We'll go over all the details. We'll go over all the different pricing options. We'll go over how we will have a customized game plan to get you to your goals in dating very quickly in a short matter of weeks and way beyond those goals, okay? And also slash away all your problems very, very fucking quick. In the first couple of weeks, we're usually blasting through most of the big problems that guys have, okay? This is a very quick and efficient and effective process. It's very systematic. The system does all the work for you, okay? So don't hesitate. If you're on the fence, jump on a free 30 minute call. We'll sort you out. If you guys are not yet a subscriber, also please subscribe below. Let me know what you guys think of all this in the comments. Please like, comment, and share. And I will see you soon on some more videos. Take care. And Jay don't stand in line. I ain't never had to wait. I'm the realest in this game. I ain't never had to fake. Just take a look at the scores. I put numbers up on the boards. I'm in a section with models. And you're at the bar trying to get out of cluster of fours. Fixed drama factor. I'm a boss tycoon. My dick smell like two chicks before noon.